Welcome to Roll for Crypt. Where we try to play as competitive as possible, but we probably forgot to roll for Crypt. I'm Lee. And I'm Cameron. On this week's episode, we're testing out commanders from Innistrad, Crimson, Val, really to see which one has the most potential. Um, but before we get into the game, please like, share, subscribe if you haven't already. It really, really helps us out. So I'm on Toxtral, the Corrosive, this week. Uh, whenever this card got spoiled, I was super excited reading it. I mean, it's a disgusting card. Every single line, like it gets worse and worse. You make tokens, you kill stuff, has an infinite mana outlet on the card itself. Uh, really excited for you guys to see this gameplay. All right, guys, I'm Alan. On this week for Roll for Crypt, I'm playing Grolnok the Omnivore. Uh, basically, just have Hermit Druid out, and I can put the whole library into the Exile, also known as the Croak Zone. And from there, I can cast all my permanents and hopefully win the game from there with a Thoracle. On this week's episode, I am playing Millicent, Restless Revenant. If you guys are uh, watchers of the channel, you probably learned by now that I kind of make shitty uh, CDH decks. This is kind of another one of them, except I have more belief in this than most. The idea is just to lock the game down. Um, I have seven rule of law effects in here. If I can lock the board down, um, cast tax spirits and make more spirits, the idea is hopefully stall it out long enough that an Elish Norn um, is enough to, to beat down the table. Um, so this week, I really wasn't excited about my options, so I was the last to pick. I ended up with Old Rutstein, um, infinite combo with Eternal Food, Eternal Food Chain? No, Eternal Scourge and Food Chain. And then make a bunch of insects, blood tokens, treasure tokens, um, somehow sack the insect tokens or use the treasure tokens to finale or devastate, some shit like that. And then Witherbloom Ancient and Chain of Smog just in case shit goes sideways, but yeah, I don't like Golgari at all. Witherbloom Ancient? Witherbloom Apprentice. Ancient. Apprentice. That's what I fucking said. <laughs> anyway, you guys know what Golgari fucking does. Not shit, so have fun watching. Yeah. Free games, anybody? Nope. No. Alrighty, draw off a turn. I'm going to uh, let a Water Grave come in tapped. I'll pass. I will play a Mana Confluence, being for a Birds of Paradise, and then drop a Mox Diamond, <whistles> discarding a Swamp. I'll play and crack a Misty. I'll pass. I'll draw. I will drop a Crypt. Tap the Crypt for a Felwar, and I will end it with playing a Wooded Foothills <laughs> and crack it. All right, I'm gonna untap, draw for turn, play a City of Breasts. I'm gonna tap, so I'll take a damage for City Breasts. Play an Arcane Signet, and I'll pass the turn. I'll tap the birds for a forest. I'll play an Elves of Deep Shadow, Mox Diamond, Mana Confluence, taking one life, and drop a Dark Confidant. Pass turn. All right, your end step. I'm gonna cast an Enlightened Tutor. All right, I'm going to my turn. Draw the Mana Crypt, untap. I'll play an Island, play the Mana Crypt, tap the Mana Crypt in the Island for an Arcane Laboratory. Untap Crypt Trigger. I didn't forget, guys. Ah, to take damage, and that's a through five, so draw. I'll play a Windswept Heath, and I'll crack it, and I wanna go get a Breeding Pool. I'm gonna have it enter, tap. And I think I'm gonna end it there. All right, untap, draw for turn, tap, tap. Uh, play a Felwar Stone, I'll pass turn. Untap, upkeep, Dark Confidant triggers, I'll reveal the top, it's a forest, take no damage, then draw for turn. I will play a Windswept Heath. Be 1-1 one, one at you, Jared. There we fucking go, dude. And then I will pass turn. Good shit, bro. And at your upkeep, I'm just gonna crack my Windswept Heath. Fuck him up. Take three. Draw. I'm gonna lie, that fucking uh, rule law is a problem for me. It's a problem for all of us, Cameron. <laughs> it's, a <fucking> problem. <laughs> it's a fucking problem. I'll tap Tundra and the Mana Crypt for a Mirror Entity. I'll pass. All right, untap, crypt trigger. Odds I take damage. That's another five, because I'm a piece of shit. Draw. Oh, that's a great to see. Look at that, guys. I'm trying to think. Same. I'm trying to think how the fuck do I get to seven mana if I can't cast more than once in <laughs> <on> a <the> turn. <laughs> I'm gonna get there the old fashioned way. It's gonna take a while. What's the play of problem? Two, three, five. Okay, so X is gonna equal three. I'm gonna cast a Finale of Devastation for three. I'm gonna get Collector Roof instead. And I'll pass turn. On top, 
I will draw. Let's see all these artifacts. Are like, <laughs> fuck off now. Got a phantasmal, phantasmal image. I'm going to target Dark Confidant. Good and plan. Good plan. I will pass the turn. Untap. Uh, Dark Confidant will trigger. Reveal the top card. Abrupt Decay. So I'll take two damage. Mm. Drop a forest. Yeah, I'll just um, I'll just pass turn. I'll roll for the crypt that I can't use. That's clean. <laughs> Pay two. Cast a unsettled mariner. I'll pass. Untap. Crypt trigger that does nothing. God damn it! Can I catch? God damn die, man. That was five. Two. All right, we're cool. Cheater. Oh my god. Oh yeah. I'll show you cheating. That's a jewel lotus that does nothing. Thank you, Collector Roof. It's also your only spell for the turn. That's fine. <laughs> Untap, uh, upkeep, reveal, to fairy. Take four. I'll drop a turn. Play a Bloodstained Mire. I'm gonna crack it. Okay, grab an underground C. Yeah, we'll go ahead and pass it up. Okay, it's your end step. Black and a green. Um, I'm gonna abrupt decay the oof. That's fine. Untap, well, upkeep, go. reveal, demonic consultation. Play a misty rainforest. I'm gonna tap for three. Generic, I'm just gonna play a Phyrexian altar. And I'll pass turn. I'll roll for crypt. That's a two. That's a two. I'm good. Untap, draw. Uh, I'll just tap these two and Mana Crypt to play a Drog Skull Captain. Three at Cam and two at Allen. I'll pass them. Uh, crypt Trigger. Six, I'm good. Draw. Play Lamb for turn. Guy's Cradle that taps for nothing right now. Ouch. While y'all think, I'm gonna crack my Misty Rainforest. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna pay two to cast a Hermit Druid. Upkeep. Reveal, it's an island. Drop turn, play set island. I'm gonna play Fairy Master of Time. So I'm gonna plus one. Just gonna go to four. I'm gonna discard Malevolent Hermit. Um, draw a card. Upkeep, Dark Confidant, reveal, Snow Covered Forest. Yeah, your deck makes me wanna foil out my next one. Bro, it's. It's looks so good. <laughs> Watch, play back the video later, you can't see anything. I'm <laughs> gonna <laughs> tap a green to uh, try and Sylvan Tutor. I feel like I might as well. Pay two, my mental misstep. Hey, wait, no, so at, at your end step, I am gonna use his plus one. I guess I'm gonna discard Culling the Weak. I'll draw a card. All right, I'll roll for Crypt. I'll roll five, I'll take three. I will untap. I will draw for turn. I'm gonna cast my commander. Oh no, I gotta do it like this. Mirror Entities coming at Allen. Mm -hmm. Drog Skull Captains coming at Allen. An Unsettled Mariner is coming at Cam. Oh, well, it's coming at the Teferi, I'm sorry, the Teferi. It's a 3-3. Three, three. I heard Cam. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna respond by plussing the Teferi to draw a card and discard a card. I'm gonna discard Cabal Ritual. All right, so three comes at Teferi, so he's gonna go down to three. I will make two spirits, Alan will take five. <laughs> <laughs> I'll pass the turn then. Uh, in step. Watch. He can't cast Full Knock. And he just dies at upkeep. I'm gonna want to rebuke the to fairy instead of tap. Uh, crypt trigger. Two. Draw. Lane for turn is an emergence zone. Chain of vapor targeting the main. The rule of law. I can't cast anything else, so. All right. All right. Would have been a whole lot cooler if I still had Fairy, but uh, untap. I tried, guys. <laughs> I tried to win, guys. <laughs> untap. <laughs> untap. Reveal. Upkeep. I'll take three. Ooh. Draw for turn. Uh, play Pluto Delta. I'm going to crack. Okay, so I'll just get a regular swampy. Oh, my. my. My chances are pretty good. Yeah, we're going to yeah. take one. All right, so go to end step. At my end step, each creature is gonna get a slime counter. Damn. Okay, so yeah, I'm gonna sack Elves of Deep Shadow for a green and Birds of Paradise for a black and Dark Confident 
for a green. So two green and one. <laughs> My discard pairs grasp. All right. Okay. Your go, buddy. All right. Two green, one generic. I'm gonna play an Eternal Witness. I will get the lovely food chain back to my hand. Oh, interesting. Uh, pass turn, another counter goes on all creatures, so I will lose Eternal Witness. All right, well, here's, here's a little promising. These will all die. Um, How many? Three. three, four, five. These will die, but because these died, I get one one spirit for each one that died. Slug boys. All right. I'll roll for crypt. God, fucking... <laughs> <laughs> that was boring. for you boys. Really Untap. Draw. Sorry. I'll play a land. Uh, mm -hmm. I'll, mm -hmm. I'll tap one. Cast the skull clamp. Oh. Tap the mana crypt. Equip the skull clamp. Draw two. Uh, use the other they one. Yeah. Equip skull clamp. There we go. Zorius drawn some cards. Now we want to see it. Equip the skull clamp. He's trying to back an answer. Uh, yes, I would hope so. <laughs> Just a snap. You, know? you already play your spell for turn. Okay. Equip the skull clamp. All right, so I will make a slug when your commander dies. I'll untap. I will upkeep, trigger, crypt. That's a one. I'll take three. Very last line. Pass turn. All right, I will untap. Drop turn. Swing. Dude, I ain't fucking doing anything to you guys. Seven's I'm coming at Hater. Are you sure? Ten coming at you. Yes. So just seven? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'll eat it. Y'all yeah, pass turn. I got eight in hand though. I got to discard. I'm going to discard Necropotence. Two Swamp. One Generic. Um, I'm going to try and cast Grim Tutor. Jump down my throat about it. Three. <laughs> no, just Draw for turn. For I'll tap an Island. I'll cast an Ascendant Spirit. I'll tap my gemstone caverns, I'll equip it, and I'll draw two, and I'll pass. All right. Oh, I didn't play a land. Pass. No, okay, end step. Tap one, sack and crack this so I can cast things at instant speed. Uh, crack the jewel lotus. Tap this for, I guess, blue, and this is gonna be three green, I wanna cast that. Right. Untap, crypt trigger. That's a one, I'll take three. Flash or something? Yeah, emergent he, zone. Yeah, he gave it flash. Draw. Yeah, I'm gonna tap three here. I'm gonna cast Muddle the Mixture for a transmute cost. This is better. I'm gonna attempt a Gilded Drake, the Tox roll. All right, so I am gonna respond to Gilded Drake entering the battlefield. So I'm gonna respond to the ETB trigger. Okay. And I'm gonna cast a Slaughter Pact targeting Gilded Drake. Crazy. That dies, it's exile with a croak counter on it. So I can cast it again later. All right, I do have to pay three at my upkeep. That's my one spell for the turn. Okay. So this gets a slime, upkeep, I will pay three, draw. I'll tap four, lose one for city brass, cast fairy. Ten coming at Jared, seven coming at Lee. Four responses. And then I will plus one to fairy. Wanna discard draw? Yeah, discard. Talisman of Dominance. Pass turn. It's another counter. Yeah, that's what I, I four. Gets another one. Yeah, am I? Oh yeah, 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 you're right, you're right. Untap. Draw. Three, I'm gonna drop food chain. Pass turn? Yeah. <laughs> uh, um, Grolnak dies. Then step, after that tox will trigger. After the? <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna put some shit point. can die. Targeting? <laughs> I'm gonna cast three scarring shape. He tried. Do you have? Oh, that's my end step. I it's two. Draw. I'm gonna play a polluted delta. <laughs> You're at four life, be careful. I'm just gonna go get an island. White. White, take one. Oh my god. Ooh, that's nice. <laughs> yep, I guess that's okay. 
pass. Well, okay, no, at your end step, I'm gonna play draw first, and then I will discard a dark ritual. We are literally playing around the rule of law this entire game. <laughs> that's a six. Draw. Polluted Delta. I will crack. Well, that's a fail to fucking find. Now pass. All right, you're in step. I'm on a plus. Draw a card. I'll discard the Meat Hook Massacre. On tap. Draw for turn. Cast on this Rainforest. Snow Arm. I'm going to minus three. Phase out, Elish Norn. Okay. I'm gonna go to combat and kill you. Yeah, I will. I'm gonna attempt to cast a snap, targeting the Toxel. All right, there go my hand. This motherfucker's just gonna cast it again. Pass the turn. Untap, draw, pay a green, and I will Nature's Claim, Arcane Laboratory. You'll gain four life. Oh, interesting. Woohoo! Yeah! He's in this. Sick! <laughs> Three. For Eternal Scourge. So I'm gonna do Eternal Scourge food chain, exile it, make four black, use four, play it again, exile it, make four green, make infinite black and green mana. Okay, I'm gonna end it with Eternal Scourge on the battlefield. Then I will pay a black, lose a life, and try and demonic consultation. And I will name uh, Zillaport Cutthroat. I'm gonna miscast the demonic consultation. I will sacrifice Eternal Scourge for a swamp, tap this for a green, whatever, and I will Imp's Mischief the miscast. I will Imp's Mischief the miscast to Imp's Mischief. Gaia's Blessing, Gaia's Cradle, Ancient Tomb, Viserys Seer, Exotic Orchard, Necropotence. All right. Okay, there's a little pork cutthroat. Use two of my infinite, one black to play Zillaport Cutthroat. So I'm gonna cast Old Rutstein. I'm gonna minus three to fairy and phase this out. I'm really scared of what Lee's doing right now because you have really, most of your important combo pieces online. You got, usual, you got Food Chain, you got the Scourge, and then what's yeah. the other card called? Zillaport Cutthroat. Yeah, so all of those online, I knew I had to stop you because if I don't, you're probably gonna win. Yeah, nah, not much library left to work with, but if Zillaport's there, I get to Sack all the insects and kill these guys. Yep, that was pretty scary. All right, so old rusting comes in. I'll mill a card. Depending on what I mill, I make a certain thing. So I'll creature, so I'll make an insect token. I will exile him to food chain, cast him again, mill another card, dark ritual. It's a non-creature, non-land, so I'll make a blood token. Just uh, sacrifice this. And then uh, two blood tokens and old rusting on the battlefield. Elish normal phase back in. Woo! I'll roll for crypts. I'll roll a one. I'll take three. I'll untap. I'll draw a card. I will play a cephalid calcium. I'll tap mana crypt for our arcane signet. Play a white and a blue. I cast a denic. I'm gonna go to combat then. Swing two. I know. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna use the gemstone caverns to equip the skull clamp. And I'll pass. Crypt trigger. It's gonna get a slime counter. Yeah, I'll just sack him instead. Yeah. Sack him. I'll pay play my own arcane signal. Okay, and step, I guess another slime counter. Alright, untap. Draw for turn. Flooded Strand, actually, yeah, I don't have any islands left in my deck. Toxic Deluge, Exilus 3. Fuck you, bitch. <laughs> Man, I'm trying it. Tap 3, I'll cast Heuristic Study. Okay. Okay, so I think in that case I swing 5 at you. Okay. My pointless Zulaport Cutthroat phases back in. I draw. Yes, I'll pay 1. I'll discard an Arbor Elf, Sack of Blood, draw a card. Do it again. Discard Find Horn Elves. Sacrifice my last blood. Draw a card. All right, his end step. I'm going to crack the Cephalid Coliseum. <laughs> <laughs> draw three. Ranger Captain. Grand Abolisher, Deafening Silence. 
Don't forget your slime counters. Uh, roll for crypt. Two, you're safe. <laughs> that one dead, then in it or no? No, they're at one. I'll play a scalding turn. Go to combat. Swing one at Allen. Are you sure it has one? It's dead. Okay, so I do get a token from you. I'll just cast a Mr. Grimoire. Do you want to pay one? Yes. <laughs> yes. Pass. So I remember a few weeks ago, you told me you thought Elish Norn was better than Toxro. Do you still it's think the same thing? It still is. In in this situation, like, Toxro was good, but, um, I, I mean... In every situation, I think Toxro was better than Elish Norn. I don't. Th I don't think Toxel ends the game the moment it comes down. If it goes three did turns, you? if okay. it goes three turns, question. then yes. Question: Did Elishnorn kill Toxel, or did Toxel kill Elishnorn? Well, there's. Th th that's not. No. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. Crypt. That's a six. I don't want to draw. I only cast Girl Knock. Can I pay one. No, you can draw them. No. Yeah. Cast Gilded Drake, targeting Toxroll again. Before that enters the battlefield, cast a dress down. Can I draw? Um, yeah, you can draw. Okay, I'll draw a card from that. Draw for turn. <laughs> so Toxroll coming at you, spending two at least. Wait, you did this at my... Yeah, so that, so that's that, so that yeah, dies, seven yeah. And a two. Okay. Yeah. Uh, that's my turn, pass. Untap, keep. Since he only gets one because he had the dress down before the end step, so. How did you cast the Gilded Drake from your graveyard? I had croak counter. It's in exile. The battlefield, it would have croak counter. Oh, it has to it enter does. from my library. Either I fucked up. Two life, and play Noxious Revival. You gonna pay one for it? Actually, I'm gonna respond to the draw trigger. Cast a Vampire Tutor. Okay, in response to that, I'm gonna oppo agent. Do you wanna pay one for that? No. All right, I'm gonna tap five on the cast. He's gonna hard cast a force of will. I'm gonna draw for the first Risky Study trigger, okay. then Vampire Tutor is gonna resolve, and then I'll have a Risky Study trigger on the stack. Okay, so that card's gonna go on top. I'm gonna draw it. I pass turn. Kill me, Crypt. Damn you, Crypt. Uh, swing. He's at one now, isn't he? Because uh, in step one at. Wait, I guess you can. Uh, mill three cards. Slug. Yep. Okay, swing seven at you. Cool. Three at Lee. Pass. So I'm gonna tap three. I'm gonna play Eternal Scourge. I'm not gonna pay for Rhystic. I'm gonna tap two. I'm gonna it. Um, yeah, I don't. Uh, I'll draw for Rhystic. Yeah, uh, pass turn. All right, untap, draw. I go to combat, you die. So no actual CDH combo win, we just all get the shit beaten out of us with a yeah, really large turned slug. Into, oh my bad. Yeah, you're just gonna fucking cut me okay. off and I'm Let's trying to return. fucking get I thought you were gonna stop talking. Well, so can, can you just out, wait you just for I stop off. talking and then you just <laughs> cut in? So it turned into what I would call a slug fest. Uh, really made a ton, <laughs> a ton of, <laughs> turned into a ton of tokens, uh, just beating everybody down with talks really, you know, seven damage here, seven damage there. Yeah, majority majority of creature decks. We just did a really great job at yeah. you know. Toxel, I would say very good card. And old Rutstein just fucking bleh. So don't forget to like, share, subscribe, um, and join the Discord if you want to chat and talk with us. About that is decks. good advice. I would say Lee, you should also join the Discord because you're not there yet, bro. Yeah, that's. Thanks for calling me out in front of everybody. <laughs> I appreciate that. Uh, one other thing though too, we are putting together a giveaway. So be on the lookout for that probably in the next few weeks. Um, gonna be some cool stuff we're giving away. Make sure you're subscribed. <laughs>